Hello children, welcome back. Today we will discuss the types of keys present in keyboard. Start with enter key. So what is the use of this enter key? It is used to move the cursor to the next line. Now what is this cursor I am talking about? This is the blinking line which is seen in the screen. Enter key, it is also known as return key. And what is the use of enter key? It is used to enter the keys on the keyboard. You can see the diagram of enter keys. There are two types of enter keys present in the keyboard. Next is space bar. Now, the space bar is the longest key on the keyboard. And what is the purpose of, the, of using space bar key? If you press the space bar, then it will give a blank space. And the blank space will be given to the right of the word. Let us know how. Here, we'll write a sentence. Okay, like I like to study computer science. So, between these sentences, you can find some gaps. Okay, now how are these gaps being made? If there were no gaps, so you won't be able to understand the sentence carefully. So, in order to provide gaps, what is being used? Space bar. How? Now, let's check it out. First of all, what we have to do is first press I. After that, we have to press space bar. Then type the word like. Then press the space bar again. Then write to. Then press the space bar again. So, in the same way, uh, we'll continue this to complete the sentence. Next in the series is backspace key. So, backspace key is a key which is marked with back arrow you can see here in the diagram now what is the purpose of this key this key is used to erase the letter okay now it will erase the letter but to the left of the cursor so children you can see a line here this is the cursor and the backspace key will always erase the letter to the left of the cursor you can see here p m p p Okay, and then you have you can see the cursor line over here. So what this back when we will press this backspace key, so what it will do? It will remove the capital P, which is on the left side of the cursor. Okay, now we are left with P M P. So this is the use of backspace. Next is delete key. So delete key is also used to erase the character. But what is the difference between the backspace key and the delete key? Is that the delete key is used to erase to the right side of the cursor, whereas backspace was used to erase to the left side of the cursor. Okay, similar example we can take here P M P P. So here you can see the cursor is uh, after the third letter P. Okay, so it has removed to the right hand side, not the left hand side. So this difference we must understand between the delete key and the backspace key. Next in the series is caps lock key. Now what is the use of caps lock key? It is used to write the alphabet in capital or small letters. Now how come in capital or small letters there is a in this key a light button is there. So when you press it on when the light is visible then it will type in capital letters or else it will type in small letters. Okay so keyboard has a light for caps lock. It will indicate whether the caps lock is on or off. Next and the last is shift key. So again, as there are two enter keys in the keyboard, there are two shift keys as well. And these keys, they are used in combination with the another keys. And some keys, they have special symbols marked on them. So in order to type those symbols, we take the help of the shift key. Now you have understood the use and the functions of the keys in the keyboard. That's all for today. Thank you so much.